morning? Well, not quite. weekly I get the milk on Saturdays Friday or Saturday depends what day I go to town anyway so I'm getting ready and this video is going to be about our town and the next town and these glares probably bothering you so I'll take them off okay so what we're gonna do now is I'm going to I'll drive around the town a little bit and point out a few businesses we don't have much in Hawthorne it only has like 500 people we have a post office, we have a, a restaurant, and a funeral home. And there might be a little, few little craft businesses, but there's not really much in Hawthorne. And there's three churches, the Methodist, Presbyterian, and the Nazarene. And I play the piano Sunday morning at the Presbyterian and the Methodist. <clears throat> and we'll go down to New Bethlehem and take a look there. I won't go all the way through the town, but the town it has our basic stores. That's where we usually go to get our groceries and, and stuff. <laughs> the little restaurants and things. It's, it's a decent sized town. I said there's probably only a th maybe over a thousand in Bethlehem, maybe maybe two. We'll see. I'm not sure how many thousand how many there are. Maybe there's a couple maybe there's three or four thousand. Anyway, so we'll take a little look at um, the rural towns of Hawthorne and New Bethlehem. Good old Hawthorne, a tiny borough, but a very pretty and safe town. Coming up there on the right, but the house wrap is my brother's house that he's been working on for a couple of years now from scratch. And that guy in the blue shirt is my brother that I'm passing. In this little town, I have the privilege to be on the borough council. And well, it's a sm terribly small town, I said, so pretty much anybody who runs gets in. building a little trailer there Church. It's one of the churches I play at. Post office over there to the right. And top bar barbecue grill to the left. See, that's this place I worked there for 
12 years, I was a starving artist that worked at Burger King. Now I'm just a starving artist. <laughs> that great building is a peanut butter factory. They have a peanut butter festival in September. So we have the bank. That's where I do my banking. s and It tells you the heat and the time. Pretty sweet. s and bank right there. And see down there, there's the shops. There's a Rite Aid, there's Dollar General, gas station, pretty much downtown New Bethlehem. And here we are at Tom's Riverside. We are at Tom's Riverside. I don't want to take my camera inside because I'm afraid people think I'm crazy. <laughs> so, into the purse goes the camera. Look, that rain is falling. I heard a clap of thunder. Maybe we're going to get some rain. Maybe some dark old clouds up there. Well, time to get going. Got my milk. This ice cream was almost sold out. So, time to head home and get those things in the refrigerator. For your refrigerator. Beautiful Red Bank Creek. On those bushes. Hawthorne coming in. Figure I better keep my camera down because other drivers might think I'm crazy. And there's the funeral home. Funeral home. Ooh, look at that dark sky. And we're back in old Hawthorne. Down the street. And there's the Nazarene church to the right. There's my street. Maple. And there's my house. The old brown job. Neighbors Great Danes. I feel. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this little journey around a, down a couple of tiny country towns. And I said I apologize for the uploading on YouTube taking so many days. It doesn't usually happen to me like this, so I'm still making my daily vlogs. It's just matter of YouTube uploading time, so that's conditions beyond my control, but I'm still working at it. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you tomorrow.